Hey guys, back with another video, and today we have another episode of ACE News. Um, I'm starting to record this a little earlier today because I have to get ahead because uh, my game, my Packers game, is at um, tonight on Sunday Night Football. So I'm going to try to get this out today um, and doing the post game for the Packers game. I'm going to try. Um, but before we get into that stuff later today, let's get into uh, the game previews for week 13, if I am positive. The Thursday game with the Ravens was postponed, so with the Sunday games, you have the football team at the Steelers, the Jaguars at the Vikings, the Browns at the Titans, the Bengals at the Dolphins, the Saints at the Falcons, the Raiders at the Jets, the Lions at the Bears, the Colts at the Texans, the Rams at the Cardinals, the Giants at the Seahawks, the Patriots at the Chargers, the Eagles at my Green Bay Packers, the Broncos at the Chiefs, the Cowboys at the Ravens on Monday night, two Monday night games, with the, the Buffalo Bills <laughs> at the the San Francisco 49ers. And uh, no sweet home Cincy again. Um, sadly, um, uh, that Bengals fan, uh, Bengals season, is having problems. Uh, I think his mic broke, um, so he can't make videos. And uh, yeah, not much happened today um, in the world of the NFL. And um, the Ravens and Sewers game did get postponed to uh, Tuesday night, uh, another Tuesday night football. Oh, last time there was a Tuesday night football. Oh my gosh, that was it roughed up my schedule. Um, yeah, not much happened. I guess I mean, there's a couple injuries. There's some shockers like the Cardinals. I meant the Patriots beat the Cardinals. The Falcons beat the Raiders, and um, the Vikings beat the Panthers by one point because Joey Sly had a 54 yarder field goal and he missed it. And, uh, yeah, you hate to see it. As I am currently recording, uh, the Saints are blowing up the Broncos. The 49ers are beating the Rams. I guess they're just the kryptonite to the Rams, apparently. And the Chiefs are up 2010 to the Buccaneers. Um, so, yeah, very interesting. My game's tonight. Um, hopefully, uh, uh, next time I, I talk, though, I, the, my game will be over. Uh -huh. So, uh, yeah. It is 9.22 Pacific time as we speak. So uh, let's just get right into this post-game stuff for the Green Bay Packers game. Um, solid, man. That's all I can say. Very, very solid. Um, we come back to Green Bay, Wisconsin, and we get fans in the stands for the first time this season. Um, it wasn't much, but, you know, baby steps. That's what we're taking right now baby steps um so you love to see it there yeah a lot happened in this game um i mean we were up 27 to 3 at one point you just you love to see it um i mean what can i say aaron jones had a big day jamal williams had a big day um Devontae adams had a big day our defense Wow, you you love to see it, but you kind of hate to see it all at the same time because I, my Packers, uh, well not my Packers, but I played them in fantasy this week and uh, yeah, rough, really rough. Um, uh, so yeah, so so much happened in this game. I mean, what? Uh, Alan Lazard had a solid game. I feel like everyone was just falling. Literally everyone. Uh, Preston Smith had a touchdown. Um, Darnell Savage had two, yes, two interceptions. Um, and <laughs> we were facing Mitch Trubisky, and I saw Mitch Trubisky tonight. Um, so yeah, the real Mitch Trubisky. Oh, he's back. <laughs> um, 
Yeah, two interceptions from Darnell Savage um, had an amazing game. He did get hurt at one point, but it looks like he's okay, um, so you love to see it there. Alan Lazard also had a big game. Um, he also got hurt. He got nailed by Jalen Johnson. He got nailed. Um, absolute dirty shot. That's why I hate the Bears so much. Um this game was this game was really rough. It was your classic Bears versus Packers game. Nick Gritty fighting, you know, your usual stuff when you have a Bears versus Packers game. And uh this game was very, very, very good. Um Aaron Rodgers hit over um fifty thousand passing yards on his career with this um with a touchdown to Bob Tunyon. Um Bob Tunyon, sorry, Bob Tunyon. Um yeah, and we got our with this win, um this continues our lead in the NFC North as always, and we're eight and three. We're the same record as the Browns. It is twenty twenty, my folks. Um but this was our 100th win. That's right, our 100th win against the Bears. Groundbreaking moment for us. Um, yeah, just, you just love to see it today. You love to see it. Like, such a good game. Um, you gotta love when you have those games, especially against a rival like the Bears. Um, and you know, you know, it, it was a, it was a Bears Packers game. What else do I have to say? You get your same gist every time. Packers come out on top, and that puts us up as again, as I'm saying, 8-3. and three. Um, So I think I'm going to stop rambling on um, this week. Pretty interesting week. Hopefully I can get this up. And, uh, yeah, there's a game on Tuesday. Um, so that will rough up my schedule um, because I still have to record predictions on Tuesday. And I usually record them, like, Tuesday, like, afternoon. And uh, the problem with that is that, uh, um, that I can't speak to, I can't speak right now. Oh, my God, I, got, I have to go, I have to go to bed. <laughs> I, I really do. Um, yeah, it, it roughs up my schedule on Tuesday because, um, oh, my God, I can't right now. I really can't. Um, because I record predictions in the afternoon, like, when I get out of school, and, uh, it's a Tuesday night game, that's what I was going to say. It's gonna be a really good game between Ravens and Steelers, but, yeah, um, I, hopefully that shouldn't mess up my predictions, uh, for the next week, too bad, um, but yeah, I'll stop rambling on, and, uh, have you guys, um, do this so I can get the video up. Um, so I hope you guys are enjoying this video. Please comment, like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you know when I post a new video. Go Pack Go. Bye, guys.